Yo, yo, Daily Fire, if it's trash, turn it off. But if it has value, please share it out for me. Of course, it's brought to you by MaxEffortMuscle.com. For all your supplement needs, go to Max Ever Muscle. All right, Daily Fire episode 310. Throw yourself right back in. I'm going to tell you a story real quick. So I was on vacation, had a good time. Actually, maybe a little bit too good of a time. But anyway, there was some weather, and I flew back in at 11.50 last night. Almost midnight, yes. Now, for you guys that follow me and know, I train at 4 a.m., which means I get up at 3.20. As I'm coming home, right? I'm coming home, and the little inner bitch is talking to me real quick. It's like, Corey, you know what? You did a pretty good job on vacation. This is the inner bitch talking. Corey, you did a pretty good job on vacation. You came back. Abs is still there. Like, you, you, you got it together. You could go ahead and sleep and just go in at 5. Now, think about this. I'm talking shit to myself, trying to allow myself to go in at five, to go in at five. Like that's only an hour, but I knew that's not what needed to happen. What needed to happen is I need to throw myself right back in. Yeah, exactly. Because when you're out of your groove and for you guys that know and have been around me and if you're new to this, you understand my morning routine is the reason why you know me. My morning routine is the reason why I've had success. My morning routine and dedication to the craft, to fitness, to just like my lifelong pursuit of changing generations of Gregory, Gregory's is a lot to do with my routine. And so for one second when I came home today, which is actually today because it was basically midnight when I walked in my house, I almost allowed myself that out to the routine but then I said to myself gee every other time you know basically in your history that you've traveled for work or whatever you would just throw yourself back in so I thought to myself get to bed as fast as possible so it's like 12 15 12 20 set my alarm for 320 no matter how I feel at 320 I'm going to the fucking gym Because now I'm going to be tired tonight, that's for sure. But the reality is I have to throw myself back in to the routine that I know leads to success. So here's what my thought process was. Am I choosing not to put myself, just because I might be a little tired, but I just came off vacation drinking bourbon, hanging out, smoking cigars on the beach, like don't cry me a fucking river. Am I going to choose not to put myself back in the routine that I know yields success when I have the opportunity. When the only time, whole time I was on vacation, all I kept thinking was, I can't wait to get back to old school. I can't wait, wait to get back to max effort. I can't wait to get back to the routine. And then that inner voice that wants comfort tried to say, nah, gee, maybe one more day. Well, then I had to choose, do I want to be one day closer to my goal Or one day further away? Do I want to have fire on this daily fire? Because that's what you should do. And that's why I'm telling you this story today. Or would I not have this to tell you? Those are the things I think about. Because the reality is, I'm me because I get up when I'm supposed to. I'm me because instead of sleep until 5, which is still fucking early, I got up at 3.20. That's why I'm me. And I had to remind myself that this morning because if I want to do some of these projects I'm working on right now, I want to get better. I want to keep pushing my level of fitness, keep pushing these businesses, keep trying to inspire. I have to keep doing what got me here. And what didn't get me here was coming in at 5. What got me here is getting up at 3.20 and making sure I'm here at 4 because I could be. See, here's the thing is, when you get a little bit a bit, a bit of success, you dictate all of it. I could come at fucking 8. No one ain't going to say nothing to me. I could come at fucking 9. I could not come at all. I don't even have to fucking show up. But that's the key. When you hold yourself to a different discipline, when you hold yourself to a whole different set of rules, That's what will continue to allow you to hopefully make progress and get an opportunity at success because success is not guaranteed, but an opportunity at it. So when you are in these type of situations, please throw yourself right back into it and you will be happy that you did. Daily Fire Episode 310. We out.